man involved in a space mission that could change history. Emily Noonan talks about the special package he wants to send to the moon and just how much that package could help out future explorers. Bruce Ha is not just thinking outside the box. He's thinking outside this world. Instead of the traditional library, this library will be on the surface of the moon. We're not going to put reams of papers on the moon. It's nickel foils like this. Each one of these foils will have 8,000 pages of text. It's the Lunar Library, containing the English Wikipedia, the Rosetta Project, and a digital library of human languages, and the first commercial mission to the moon. I've um, discovered a, a, a technology that can uh, not only archive humanity's uh, information, but archive it in a, in a format that won't take up a lot of space. The film is made out of nickel which has a melting point of 2,600 degrees Fahrenheit. The moon's surface temperature varies a couple hundred degrees Celsius. No match for his technology. 10,000 years from now, we were cavemen riding on, uh, on caves. 10,000 years from now, imagine to be able to uncover something like this and know what our civilization was like today. It's a gift to uh, future humanity. Emily Noonan, News 8. So astrobotic technology, which flies hardware systems into space, will carry the lunar library to the moon on its peregrine lunar lander and then store it on the lunar surface. The lunar launch is set for 2020, and the next mission is set for Mars. <laughs>